Today we're going to introduce the Makey Makey, one of our favorite tools for exploring circuitry. Makey Makey is an invention kit that lets you turn everyday objects into keys for your computer. It was co-invented by Eric Rosenbaum and Jay Silver, who were students together at the MIT Media Lab's lifelong kindergarten group. Makey Makey is a circuit board that lets you create a circuit using anything that can conduct at least a tiny bit of electricity. The board plugs into your computer through a USB cable, and instead of having typical keys that you would press, you turn everyday objects into your keyboard. As a quick review, here we have a simple circuit. It has a battery that provides the power, wires for the electrons to move through, and a light bulb that the electricity can power. We can also add in a switch, and this lets us unconnect or connect, or open and close, the circuit as needed. Here's the Makey Makey board. There are lots of components of the board, but don't get overwhelmed. We'll talk about those other parts in future videos, but today we're mainly focusing on the arrow keys, spacebar, and the bar along the bottom labeled Earth. We're going to walk you through the steps of setting up a Makey Makey keyboard that controls a simple animation. The animation, programmed in Scratch, moves the cat around the screen when the arrow keys are pressed and makes the sound meow when the spacebar is pressed. Here the spacebar is represented by a banana, which we'll explain in a bit. So that's our animation, but what if we wanted to play it in a more creative way, without using the keyboard? That's where the Makey Makey comes in. The Makey Makey allows us to design circuits and switches using everyday objects to signal to the computer that a key has been pressed. Here, instead of arrow keys, we're going to be using arrows we've cut out of aluminum foil, and instead of a spacebar, as promised, we'll be using a banana. Right now, nothing is connected. So first, we need to turn the Makey Makey on by plugging it into a computer using the USB cable. When you plug it in, the lights will flash for a second, and the power indicator light should turn on to indicate that the board is properly connected. If any pop-ups or alerts open on your computer, just close them out. You don't need to run any software or install anything to get the Makey Makey to work. Let's first connect our spacebar. To do that, plug an alligator clip into the port labeled space on the Makey Makey. We also need to plug an alligator clip into one of the ports for Earth at the bottom of the board. Now we have an open circuit that gets power from the Makey Makey board, which is plugged into the computer. The electricity runs up from the board into the wire, and we can close the circuit by touching the two alligator clips together so the electricity can flow back down the other wire closing the circuit. Each time we touch the clips together, the green light above space should turn on, and a signal that the space bar is being pressed is being sent to the computer. Instead of touching the alligator clips together, we can connect the Makey Makey to everyday objects and turn them into the keyboard keys. And here, we are going to turn a banana into the space bar. Clip the alligator clip that is connected to the wire plugged into space to your banana. This next part is really important and easy to forget. The other side of our circuit is coming out of the earth bar of the Makey Makey. So we always need to be connected to earth if we want to close the circuit and press our keys. Now you can just hold on to that alligator clip. But one cool trick that we like is clipping the earth clip to your watch. You just need to make sure that the metal part of the clip is touching your skin in some way. Now one side of the circuit is connected through me, and one side is connected through the banana. So now as long as I'm touching the earth clip, whenever I touch the banana, the space key is pressed. Now let's get back to that program we wrote in Scratch that uses the space bar and the arrow keys. When the space bar is pressed, the program plays that sound meow. When the arrow keys are pressed, the cat moves in the corresponding direction. Let's plug our arrow keys into our Makey Makey, and then we'll clip them to these aluminum foil arrows. Now we can play. When I touch the up arrow, the cat moves up. When I touch the down arrow, the cat moves down, and so forth. When I touch the banana, it makes the meow sound, because that's how we wrote our program. You can use the Makey Makey for any program or game that uses the arrow keys and spacebar. And there are links to programs that work well with the Makey Makey on their website, makeymakey.com, under the how-to section of their site. 
You can also use many other objects in addition to aluminum foil and bananas. Anything that is even the tiniest bit conductive will work. So most fruits and veggies will work, as will Play-Doh and pencil graphite, metal utensils, and lots of other things. Go out and explore, and check out our other circuit and makey-makey videos.